the narcissist's illusion of moving on. They show a deceptive appearance and impression of moving on and being happy, which plants a false idea and belief in your mind. It makes you think they're living their best lives without you, while you're left miserable and alone, which leaves you feeling like you're missing out on something. But they're pretending. They're behaving as if it's true when they know that it's not. They're pretending to be happy. They're pretending to have moved on. To have a new boyfriend or girlfriend. But it isn't real. It's just as fake as what they had with you. They displayed an illusion to the world that they were happy with you. While they abused you behind closed doors. And their new relationship is no different. It's just as fake as yours was. They never cared about you. And they don't care about the new person they're with. The only person they care about is themselves. Which is why there's really no such thing as a relationship with a narcissist. Because for you to have a relationship with someone, they have to care about you. They have to consider you. And that's just something you're never going to get from a narcissist. So it's impossible for you to have a real relationship with them. Because their only concern is what they can get from you. Or how you can make them feel. It has nothing to do with you as a person. They will tell you they love you. They will tell you they care about you. They will tell you they want to get married and have children with you. They will tell you whatever they think you want to hear. But that doesn't mean they're really about it. They don't care about anyone but themselves. They're not interested in building with you or anyone else. They're just saying it to get your money or to have sex with you. It doesn't go any deeper than that. Which is why all they can do is mirror you. All they can do is reflect back to you whatever you like or whatever you're interested in. So that they can get what they want from you. And it's no different in their new relationship. It's fake. It's an illusion. They don't love the person they're with. They love what they're getting. They love how that person is making them feel. But that person isn't getting anything back in return. They're being deceived. Because the narcissist doesn't have anything to give. They're just robbing the new person of their qualities and virtues. Just as they did with you. They're just telling them what they want to hear so that they can get what they want. So there's no reason for you to be jealous. There's no reason for you to feel like you're missing out. You're not missing out on anything other than manipulation and lies. You can't coexist with a narcissist without being fake just like them. Because if you don't accept and validate the illusions of their false self, they will turn against you. They will show you who they really are. They will show you that they were just using you the entire time. But until the new person comes to that realization, the narcissist is going to continue playing their role. And you may think that they've moved on and they're happy. You may feel like you're missing out. Because they will be displaying their best moments together. But they know how to create an orchestration.
They know how to coordinate the elements of a situation to produce their desired effect, to make you feel how they want you to feel. It's an illusion. They want you to focus your attention on what they're doing so that you feel like that's all there is. But there's so much more to life than what you had with the narcissist. There's so much more than their activities and friends. There's a big world out there. And when you start to see them from an outsider's point of view, they're really not as special and important as they claim to be. You begin to see the illusion. It all starts by blocking them on social media, going no contact, and focusing your attention on more important things in your life. Things that are more deserving of your attention because they're not doing anything for you. They never cared about you. So you shouldn't care so much about them because they're not deserving of you. They proved that with their actions. So forgive yourself for being involved with them. Realize that it's all an illusion and cut them out of your life because then you will see how insignificant they are. You will realize that you don't need them because they never contributed anything of value to your life. They were only taking value away from you. So let them think that they've moved on and they're happy without you. Let them find someone else. You will see that they're fooling them too. They made your world seem so small. But when you leave them behind, you will realize that there are so many people for you to meet. There are so many things for you to explore because their world is small and they condensed you into their world. They made you believe that they're as good as it gets for you, as though you're not going to find anything else. And that kept you trapped. That's what locked you in. But when you realize there's so much more than that, you free yourself. And then it's so much easier for you to move on. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching at narcsurvivor.co.uk Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.